using set drive and key. In this lesson, we will learn how to set a set drive and key. Set drive and keys are generally used when we want it to make the movement of one object influence the other object. For example, by the time this ball reaches this position in X axis, the size of this torus should be increased. To happen like this, we should make the translate X property of the ball influence the XYZ scaling property of the torus. The translate X should be the driver and the scale XYZ of the torus should be the drive and keys. To set the driver and drive and keys, first go to the animate menu and click on set in the set drive and key. Now set drive and key attributes are displayed. Now select the P-Sphere and click on Load Driver. Now all the transformations of the sphere are displayed here. In this, we are going to take the Translate X property as a driver. After selecting this, select the Torus. After that, click on Load Driver. Now we selected scale XYZ in the drive and key. Now select the sphere, go to the channel box in this minus 14.406 value is found at translate X and 111 values are found at scale XYZ of the torus. Now by pressing the key we could set the first key. Now the translate X is keyable to scale XYZ. After that, this ball has come close to the torus in 55th frame. In this frame, the value of the sphere is 1.388. In P torus scale values, let us type 666. Now press the key again. In the same way, when the animation goes to the 200th frame, then change the P torus scale values to 111 again. When the P sphere moves in the X axis, then according to its movement, the torus gets scaled. Now close this and let us run the animation. In this way, when the ball comes close to the ring, it grows big, again it becomes small, as the ball goes out of it. In the next lesson, we will learn about the motion path animation.